PNC Maverick with Craig Pretzinger. Fuel for your mind and agency in under five minutes. Hello, PNC Mavericks. Craig Pretzinger here, and today we're exploring one of the most fascinating and often misunderstood laws from Robert Greene's 48 Laws of Power, law number 11, which states, learn to keep people dependent on you. Now, I know what some of you might be thinking. Craig, that sounds a bit manipulative. Aren't we supposed to be empowering our clients and team members, not making them dependent on us? And to that I say, you're absolutely right. The goal is never to create a one-sided, unhealthy dependence that limits people's growth and autonomy. But here's the thing. When we look at the most successful and influential people in the insurance industry and in business in general, we often find that they have a certain kind of gravitational pull. People are drawn to them, rely on them, and keep coming back to them again and again. And there's a psychological principle at play here that can help us understand why. It's called contagion. The idea that emotions, attitudes, and behaviors can spread from person to person almost like a virus. We see this all the time in our daily lives. When someone around us is feeling stressed or anxious, we often start to feel those same emotions ourselves. When someone is excited and passionate about an idea, that enthusiasm can be infectious and inspire us to take action. In the business world, contagion can be a powerful tool for building influence and creating value. When we consistently provide exceptional service, expertise, and support to our clients and colleagues, we create a kind of positive contagion that spreads throughout our networks. People start to associate us with positive emotions and experiences. They come to rely on us as trusted advisors and go to resources. And over time, that dependence can create a virtuous cycle of loyalty, referrals, and long-term success. But here's the key. It's not about creating dependence for dependence's sake. It's about becoming so valuable and indispensable that people can't help but keep coming back to you. It's about being the insurance professional who always goes above and beyond, who anticipates needs and solves problems before they even arise. It's about being the agency leader who creates a culture of growth, empowerment, and shared success so that your team members are inspired to bring their best selves to work every day. When you focus on creating that kind of positive contagion, the dependence takes care of itself. People naturally want to work with you, learn from you, and stay connected to you over the long haul. But it's also important to strike a balance. We don't want our clients or team members to become so dependent on us that they lose their own sense of agency and autonomy. That's why the most effective leaders and advisors are also skilled at empowering others. They provide guidance and support, but they also help people develop their own skills, knowledge, and decision-making abilities. They create a sense of shared ownership and responsibility rather than a one-sided dependence. So, how can you ethically leverage the power of contagion in your own insurance career? Here are a few strategies to consider. Focus on creating value. Always be asking yourself, how can I provide exceptional service, expertise, and support to my clients and colleagues? How can I anticipate needs and solve problems in a way that creates a wow experience? Be consistent. Positive contagion is built through consistent, reliable behavior over time. Show up every day with the same level of dedication, professionalism, and care and people will come to trust and rely on you. Communicate proactively. Don't wait for people to come to you with questions or concerns. Reach out regularly to check in, share updates, and offer support. Show that you're invested in their success and well-being. Empower others. While it's important to create a sense of dependence, it's equally important to help people develop their own skills and autonomy. Provide training, resources, and opportunities for growth and celebrate their successes along the way. Lead by example. As a leader or advisor, your own attitudes and behaviors are highly contagious. Model the kind of positivity, resilience, and growth mindset that you want to see in others and watch as it spreads throughout your team and network. By applying these strategies consistently over time, you can harness the power of contagion to build influence, create value, and become an indispensable resource in the insurance industry. But remember, it's not about manipulation or control. It's about earning people's trust and loyalty through genuine value creation and positive impact. And when you do that, the rewards are immeasurable. You'll build deeper, more meaningful relationships with your clients and colleagues. You'll create a sense of shared purpose and momentum that propels everyone forward. And you'll experience a level of fulfillment and success that goes 
far beyond just making the sale or closing the deal. So my challenge to you, PNC Mavericks, is to start thinking about how you can ethically leverage the power of contagion in your own career. How can you become so valuable and indispensable that people can't help but keep coming back to you again and again? And how can you use that influence and success to make a positive impact on your clients, your colleagues, and the insurance industry as a whole? Because when you master that kind of positive contagion, there's no limit to the impact you can have or the legacy you can leave. As always, keep pushing boundaries, keep questioning the status quo, and keep being the maverick that you are. Until next time, this is Craig Pretzinger signing off. Hey there, want to hear more? Join me with my co-host buddy, Jason Feltman at the Insurance Dudes podcast or the Insurance Dudes website over at dub.thiDudes.com. Please, if you liked what you heard, click subscribe and you'll get the newest episode each time.